just want to welcome you to another 3ABN Today program. Mm -hmm. My name is Jill Marconi and we have an exciting cooking program planned for you today in our kitchen. First, I want to introduce you to our special guests. We have some guests that are pretty familiar to you, but <laughs> I'm surprised they're on the kitchen. Yes, they are. <laughs> hey, yes. You know, not too often, but uh, with Brandy here, I'll, I'll come and uh, That's right. support you all today. That's mm -hmm. pretty special. we got Danny and Brandy here, so I'm so glad Brandy is my good friend. So it's nice to be working with uh -huh. her and good to have you here too, Danny. Well, when we saw the recipes and what was being done, we were afraid if we weren't here, as <laughs> soon as the program's over, Mark, that everybody would eat the food and we wouldn't get any. So mm -hmm. we figure That's we'd right. be right here at the, you know, as soon as it's over, That's we right. can dig in. Well, maybe we'll start eating before then, too. You never know, right? <laughs> <laughs> we can eat during taste it for you guys. Uh, taste panels, taste panels. <laughs> now to our special guest, though, Chef Mark Anthony. Hi, how you doing? We're uh -huh. so glad to have you here. You've been here before, but times, yeah. for our friends yeah. who maybe didn't see that program. Mm -hmm. Tell us where you come from and what you used to do and what you do now. Um, I'm from Las Vegas, Nevada, and I worked at a lot of the casinos and cooking for a lot of the celebrities and Jack Nicholas and Montel and Ooh. REO Speedway, a lot of the rock stars. Okay. And I finally, you know, I just said to myself, I just can't do this anymore. I can't work for the casinos in that type of right. environment. Right. So um, now I've got a little spice company that I, you know, you know yeah. create spices. I have 21 of my own spice blends. Yeah. Give us examples and, of what kind uh, of spices you do. I've got uh, Jamaican blends, mm -hmm. Southwest blends, oh, Italian awesome. blends. Mm -hmm. uh, I like the Italian. That's yeah, like. pretty much everything you could think of, and uh, most of it's commercial sizes, the big okay. institutional okay. sizes. Okay. That's right. So, and uh, just came down here to cook for the camp meeting, and oh, decided, you know, yeah. we'd come over here on the television and show you some of the things that we created for the camp meeting this and year. You did a great job too. Yeah. Everybody yeah. loved the food for sure. Yeah, it was fun. We had a lot of fun there. Yeah. Uh -huh. The food was very mm -hmm. good. I got a lot of good positive feedback. People mm -hmm. saying, "Oh, the food was good," and you. Got Got everybody through Sabbath lunch in 28 minutes, you told me. Yeah, I've been wow. practicing. <laughs> yeah, really fast. We just went through in a hurry. That's very good. Yeah, that's right. Very good. Yeah. Uh -huh. And he made a special creation, too, that we want to show you. Um, but we're not going to tell you about it yet. In a few minutes, yeah. you get to see the special creation. We're going to do it at the and end we're, of the Yeah, we're going to do it at the end of the show. So if you've got anybody at home that you want to get a hold of, uh, people in the restaurant business, you know, this is a great time to witness and say, hey, turn on 3ABN and watch what we're going to be right. doing later on in the show because it's just right. going to be right. spectacular. Oh, yeah. We're going to have a lot of fun with it. That's right. right. Good. Mm -hmm. Well, first, let's look at the recipes we're going to be making. Why don't you tell us what recipes we're making here, Mark? Well, the first recipe is going to be a peanut brittle. Oh, that sounds good. And mm -hmm. it's really good. And it's so easy. It's such an easy recipe to make. Yeah. Uh, and then we're going to do some blueberry parfaits. Ooh. Okay. And yeah. that's going to be made. We're going to do a couple recipes with that. It's going to be a whipped cream. Yeah. And then we'll make a little blueberry pie filling so we can make our parfaits with it. Mm -hmm. All right. I can't uh, wait to try that. Oh, so they're, yeah, they're delicious. Likes that. You've hit a good oh, point yeah, with that's her. Right. I can you tell. <laughs> um, also, we're going to make a South Padre enchilada bake. And that's made with tortillas and enchilada sauce and, and southwestern. A, type. Yeah, uh -oh. yeah, a lot of TVP products that we're going to be using in this okay. show. Okay. Uh, we're also going to make a Lone Star chili, which is a Texas <laughs> chili. Right. Yeah. Very nice. And uh, and that's really good. We can do it with whipped cream and you know make it a whole bunch of different ways. Really? All right. And our last item is going to be. A Texas cheesesteak sandwich. Ooh, that sounds uh, that's, and you know, like a that's Philly cheesesteak sandwich? Yes. But this one's going to be made uh, with eggplant instead of. Oh, right. Oh, and it is fabulous. Yeah. Just yeah. fabulous. Yeah. 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 A lot of fun. I dig eggplant. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Good. Well, let's go to our first recipe for that peanut brittle. You want to read that recipe mm -hmm. for us, Brandy? Sure. You'll need one cup of sugar, one cup light corn syrup, one cup peanuts, and one teaspoon of baking soda. You know, Mark, I've never made peanut brittle, but it was always something like when I was growing up at Christmas time, mm -hmm. I right. had That's peanut brittle. So this is really special to learn how yeah. to make it. And how easy. I mean, yeah. I, a lot of my recipes, what I try to do is I try to get the simplest way to make them. Mm -hmm. And it might take me a couple tries, but I'll, you know, I'll figure out the easiest way. And this one is a one-cup system. One cup, one cup, one cup. Yeah. Okay. And you're done. I can handle that, right, Brandy? We can <laughs> and, handle um, that? Yes. Can we handle we can that? Handle <laughs> we can do that. Of course, since, since we've got a... Uh, a few crew that really like peanut brittle, and I know Jim loves it. So, uh, made a lot, I so we're actually yeah. going to do a two cup, two cup, two cup. Oh yeah, we can handle. So because oh. people on television are going to yeah. say that's an awful big cup, you know, yeah, but but right. these are actually two cups. Apiece. Okay. All right. Okay. So the first thing we want to do is just put all these in the pot, and I'll let okay. you just start putting these in. All right. One at a time. Uh, that's the corn syrup. Good. And light corn syrup is what you use for this. Hmm. Good. And lots of uh, sugar and peanuts. This is so simple. It's so simple. Yeah. And the kids love to do it. If you're going to have the kids do it, 
at home, make sure you're supervising them because this temperature gets really hot, right. and you know you have to be really be careful. careful. But they have so much fun making it. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, sugar, and then two cups of peanuts. Yes. Now don't snitch any, Danny. No peanuts. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah, those peanuts are tempting. I love yeah. Oh yeah. Sometimes I'll even put in extra peanuts. Or if, oh, what's really? your favorite nut? You could well, do some yeah, like almonds, wal walnuts, or walnuts. Yeah. Wal yeah, love yeah, it. Yeah, you could use pretty almonds. much anything in this. So we'll turn the uh, yeah. stove on there. Of course, and um, of course cashews. I think it's the front one. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How far you want it to go to? There you go. Full blast. <laughs> yeah. Because we're going to keep stirring this until it gets up to temperature, and it's going to take right. quite a while. It's How are we doing? We it's going to good? take literally might be 15, 20 minutes. Yeah, uh, hopefully it won't oh, take three or go. four days. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <That's laughs> Especially for stirs. So, um, <laughs> and as soon as that's ready, then we'll kind of get now back to it. What's this in here? That is a candy thermometer. Oh, okay. Thermometer. And what we're actually going to do is we're going to take it to this point right here that says hard crack oh, candy. Cool. Oh. And it's actually at, right at about 310 degrees. Okay. okay. 310, 312. That's, That's when we hot. know. Is when it gets to that temperature, yeah. then you know we're ready to pull that All off right. of there. Now, where can okay. we get one of those thermometers? Any place. Any place. Uh, any place. Yeah, yeah Walmart. Um, oh, okay. Any, any, just right any store. Yeah. I buy a lot of commercial equipment. If you can find a commercial equipment store in your town, if you, especially in the bigger towns. Mm -hmm. right. You can buy heavy duty equipment that's going to last you a lifetime instead of buying you know, right. other stuff that's going to be right. broken a month or two. Right. Sure. Now what so. about this? Does this have to go in or not? This is the um, baking soda uh -huh. and we're going to wait until that's done. Oh, and then, it doesn't go in now. Right. Okay. We'll, we'll hold this off till okay. later. Okay. okay. And one thing I do is yes. when the peanut brittle is done and it hardens, mm -hmm. you want to put it in a plastic bag. Because now, that, that keeps the moisture off of it. All right. If you leave it set out, the moisture yeah. will make it sticky. Mm -hmm. So as soon as you put it in a bag, That's it keeps perfect. it it keeps it nice yeah. and uh, dry. All right. Yeah. And we got some that are so, finished. And here's some oh, they look that, good. Oh, they it do. does. Yeah. yeah, don't they look good? Delicious. Oh, man, that's nice. Good. They now, will disappear as soon as this program is over and have a feeling, Mark. We've already that's sampled right. this on the camp meeting. That's now. right. We had this at camp meeting. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, really good. That's very good. That's right. Okay, I'm let's go to our Randy. next recipe. Good, thanks. Let's read that recipe for the whipped cream. For that, you need one 13 and a quarter ounce box of extra firm silicon tofu, one fourth cup of soy margarine, one fourth cup of honey, one to four teaspoons soy milk, one and one half teaspoon vanilla, one teaspoon lemon juice, and a pinch of salt. Well, I'm excited about learning how to make a soy cream. Yeah, this is actually a whipped cream topping that yes. you can make That's out good. of tofu. That's perfect. And, uh, and that, I've seen a few recipes for it. Yes. Uh, these are the ingredients here. Uh, this is a extra firm, but a silky type. Okay. So that's the kind you want to look for. Yeah. And then we've got some uh, uh, margarine. vegan margarine there yeah. and some honey. Which I actually, I, I like to use a little extra honey. I just um, like okay. that sweet yeah. too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no sugar in this you one. You guys do, don't yeah, this, this, okay. this one's actually sugar-free to make up okay. for all the sugar in oh, the peanut brittle over here. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> nice. uh, this right here is just a little bit of vanilla. Oh, okay. Now, you can use almond. I even okay. put a little splash of banana. Oh, extract in there. that would be good. And, uh, and when you're looking for your extracts, make yeah. sure that you check the labels because some of them have alcohol in them. So you want to get the non-alcoholic ones. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then we've got a little bit of lemon juice and a little bit of salt. Fresh squeezed lemon juice? Not this no, time. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it would be good I though. I shouldn't have asked, right? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, this is soy milk and we're not going to put it all in there though because we're okay. not sure how much moisture was in that tofu. So right. it might take a tablespoon, it might take two or three depending okay. how thick you want it. Okay. So. We're just going to put a little bit in there for now, and then we'll try that and see how it goes. Okay. So you can start blending, and how are we doing over here? Well, I'm looking. I don't want to panic, but it's 200 and about 30 degrees. How much? Is it already that high? Yeah. So that's not taking it? very long at all. I'm going to make some noise. Uh, 310, 315. Oh, we got a little ways to go. Okay. okay, and then you can stop it a little bit and do a little mixing with the, Good. With the uh, mixer there. If I can get the lid off. Safety first. Safety, safety first. Safety oh, first. Right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty important. Oh. That's right. Well, that's boiling real good over there, isn't it? It sure is. 
I can smell Coming right it. along, yes. And what will happen with this is you'll actually see it change color because right now it's a whitey, white oh, yeah. color. Oh, yeah. And then it'll actually get browner and browner. And I can tell just by looking at it usually. I don't even need well, the thermometer anymore. I think this is healthier than it appears because I think all that is coming out is the sugars right. mm -hmm. steamed out. It's right. yeah. Yeah. So it's going to be pretty healthy by the time it's through here. That's right. I'm going to blend again. I mean, that's just one way to look at it. Yeah. A little bit more. We'll probably put a little bit more of this in there. Mm-hmm. That's kind of an interesting lid, isn't it? You know, it? I'm having a hard time with that. Here, we'll just put it all in there. I think it's going to take it all. Good. Okay. Yeah. That's looking good, though. You could and leave the lid, lid off, Jill, and make it interesting. <laughs> <laughs> we could, couldn't we? That's right. We could have uh -huh. a disaster. <laughs> yes. There we go. Yep. And it, that's just turning just like that. Perfect. Now it's working. Got that nice little spin on it. And that's it. All done. And it's that easy. Nice. And you want to make it really smooth, you know. Perfect. And I've got one ready right here too. Oh, this yeah, one. That's nice. Yeah. I can see it. And you can make it thinner, that? or thicker. Oh, wow. That's mm -hmm. nice. Yeah. Sure is. Perfect. And the flavor is just amazing. Yeah. People are like, "There's no milk in it. There's no cream in it. There's right. no sugar in it." Yeah. You know, yeah. and it, it is. It's just yeah. fabulous. Yeah. So. Good. Now yeah. we're gonna make our blueberry. I think we pie. should. Yeah. Go to the next recipe. And we're gonna make and, some parfaits. And we'll do the blueberry yeah. pie filling. Good. You want to read that recipe for us, Brandy? Sure. You need one quart of fresh blueberries, washed. Three fourths cup sugar, dash of ground cinnamon, a dash of nutmeg, one teaspoon of lemon juice, and three tablespoons of cornstarch with water. This looks so good, Mark. Yum. Mm -hmm. Blueberries, don't they look good? Yep. Oh, makes me wow. makes me want to eat them. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And the blueberries, you can actually blend them if you want, or you can use them whole. It just mm -hmm. depends if you want to use them for a pie or if you want to, you know, mm -hmm. whatever type of applications you want yeah. to use, preserves and yeah. jellies and stuff yeah. like that. But I'm going to put these right in here. Okay. Step back. Yes. Purple and white, don't mix. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> there we go. That's right. Yeah. So we'll put all those in there. Okay. And then we've got uh, some sugar. That can go in there. A okay. uh, little bit of lemon juice. Oh, yeah. Is that to offset the sugar? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, Give it just a little bit of bite. Exactly. Of the sweet. Uh huh. Yeah. And some cinnamon mm -hmm. and some nutmeg. Mm. All right. And isn't that the cinnamon and nutmeg? People think, are you kidding me? You're putting that in a blueberry pie filling? Uh -huh, right. And it just, it just brings an aroma right out of it. It's Amazing. just fabulous. Yeah. 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 And what we're going to do is we're going to stir that a little bit okay. and let it cook. In fact, we can turn the cooker on for this one. Okay. I'm on, is this Let's second this. one? I'm yeah, almost can... at. Uh... Yeah, what's it at? Uh, this let's is. See if I got the right oh, one. Okay. There you go. Yeah. Oh, you're almost 300, 300. degrees. Yes. We're going to be ready for that in no time. Okay. Okay. That's good. How's yeah. this other one? Is it on good? And this is a corn starch. Yes. And water. Yeah. Uh, technically known as slurry. Yes. <laughs> Isn't that weird? Slurry. Isn't that weird? That is. That's different. Yeah. And that's our thickening agent there. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Slurry. So why do you mix it here instead of just tossing in the corn starch and water in there? Uh, What's I don't know. <laughs> it's just the way I've done it since well, I was a kid. Right. Right, you know, yes, right I got to be honest about it. You know, I mean, I when I learned cooking, I learned cooking up at Mount Rushmore, and I was yeah. cooking when I was 12, 13 Did years old. Yeah. Oh wow! Yeah, wow. and and we would actually uh, be down there with the big chefs, and and yeah. they just threw everything together. I just learned, wow. you know. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because right. I was so. asking you, Mark, you never went to uh, chef school or culinary school no, or anything. No, no. Well, he, he did, it sounds like. Well, he sat under the... When he was 12 and 13. Sat under the, the <laughs> yeah, the big boys. That's yeah, right. I did, but I was teaching the instructors more than they were teaching the classes. And I was like, I'm not going to pay this kind of money if you can't <laughs> you teach know? me anything. Because yeah. back when I was younger, I would go to the library like every day uh -huh. and, and just pick up books. You know, I'd pick up like sometimes 10, 15 books. And the next week I'd come back and get 10, 15 more. And I was just thriving on it. When I was going to college... I was working at three, four, five different restaurants every quarter, you know, when I was in school. And, uh -huh. wow. and just, you know, I learned everything. I'd go to the next place. Even if it was less pay, I just had a, wow. you know, it's, drive it's to want to learn. Yeah. You know, it so. sure is. Yeah, it's yeah. the yeah. gave you yeah. cooking. Right. Yeah. yeah. Mark, I think this is done. I, we're oh, okay. we're done. almost 320. Ooh. Okay, let's shut so that one off. Okay. off. Oh, that's awesome. Yep, you're there. Perfect. Right. Perfect. Good job. Okay, so this has to be really fast. Okay. And, okay. Um, this is, we're going to take a couple pans. We're going to spray it. Good. Take this off. Sure. And this is where the hot spot is. <laughs> okay, and I'm actually going to use a towel. Oh. I'm going to oh. And we're going to leave that there. I'm going to twist this so I don't get it. All right. And leave that in there. I'll take that. Okay. okay. All right. Here we go. Now you're going to see the fun part on this. Yeah. 
And what else do we need in there? We got the one the cup, one soda. cup, one oh, cup. Oh, yes, the baking, baking soda. soda. Okay. So this is going to go in here and watch this change colors. Oh, wow. Oh, oh much lighter. lighter. Better already. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It does, yeah. Right. This is like peanut butter. Woo! Like that. Look at that. Look That's at that. Great. Wow. And, that and it is going to harden so fast. Wow. Hmm. I'll be amazed with this. Okay, here we go. And you can do big spots, you can do little spots. Oh, you okay. Can, you know, kind of do it any way you want here. Do you hmm. cut them later when they harden or not? It's just whatever shape they are in now? Yeah, we'll bust them up later. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Good man. And I'm going to do all this right here. That is good. Now, there's two ways you can do this peanut brittle when you get to this point. Uh-huh. And you can leave it fluffy like this. Yeah. And it'll actually cool a little airy inside uh -huh. or you can kind of beat it down uh, like this oh, and see how it falls apart sure and you is. see yeah. the difference between yeah. the two Huge of them. Difference. Is it going to rise up again? Nope. Huh. And most people do this. They're going to leave it, you yeah. know, and get it all packed down like yeah. that. Yeah. Just getting so. the air out of it. Wow, that's yep. amazing. We thought maybe you were going to yep. do the dishes, Danny. So just like uh, that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just like that. About it. You got some apples back there, though. Oh, another one? Okay. <laughs> I'm okay. making a pile. So we've got the blueberry done. I'm going to put these right up front here. And then we can make our blueberry parfaits. Oh, good. Yeah. Here's some glasses. Mm -hmm. And blueberry parfaits. Just the right amount. You can make them any way you want. Yeah. Uh -huh. okay. We've got the blueberries here. Good. We've got the whipped cream here. Good. And this is just some cake, and you can use any are, type of cake. Are we supposed to be stirring this yet or no? Yeah, it, it actually will um, Do it stir okay. itself pretty okay. much. Okay. Um, All right. uh, but the parfaits, you can kind of create them any way you want. Uh, this is a great one for the kids to do. Uh -huh. you know, yeah, if, yeah. if you get the kids, right. they just get love it. Hands in there and and, um, That's fun. The whole trick to it is to get your first piece down there like okay. that. Uh -huh. And then if you put some cake in there. Good. You know, and Ooh, you're just going to do different yeah. layers. You can see the one we've done already there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Isn't and that beautiful? It is. Oh, yeah. And then when you do the whipped cream, the whole object is to, to hit do? the glass. Hit the glass. You've got to hit That's the glass good. on the sides. Yeah. See how I'm hitting the glass? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't matter what kind of layers you do, as long as you hit the glass on the sides. <clears throat> is this for looks or what? Yeah. yeah. And and when you, see, when you hit the glass like that, mm -hmm. yep, yeah, okay. come on in. All right. And then you can just take the next one, and you just create it any way you want. Oh, hit see, the glass. Around, huh? You hit the glass with oh, it. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then you get your different layers. Yeah. See how easy that is? Mm -hmm. huh. Oh, wow. And you can throw them in any way you want. We have a model. The to kids look can at have already. so much fun with this. Yeah, we do. That's right. That helps. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. You can just play with it any way you want. Yeah. Okay. Come on in. We got to bring the pros in. We okay. got to bring the pros in. All right. Yeah. Let me. We got two spoons for you. And, okay. Okay. and then I'll come over okay. here and I'm give just, this a little okay, stir. Okay. Let's over a little bit here. Oh yeah. Yeah. Right. Come over more. We'll give this a little stir yeah, here. How much to put in? Well, whatever. Yeah. And you can do different ones. You can flip back and forth. You really can't go wrong. Any way you make these, they're gonna taste. I'm hungry. Absolutely fabulous. I'm hungry right now, so I may be putting more of what I need to. That's right. Yeah, so just go ahead. Huh? I'm sorry. Okay. You ate the cream. No, you're fine. There you go. You're uh, hitting the glass. Are we putting some on top time. of it, too, or are we put? Whoa, mine doesn't look as fancy as that oh. one over there. See that? <laughs> I've dipped Well, the more time you take, yeah. the, you know, take the better the presentation is going to be. Okay. But for the most part, sure. they're all going to look gorgeous. Yeah. And when you pull these out of the fridge, especially if you have company, you can do these ahead of time. And that's kind of why we were doing the desserts first. Yeah. Because some of these things take a little while right. yeah. to um, set yeah. before we, we see go to our There's next a step way to there. put this in, and then there's really a way. You've got to kind of do this and, <laughs> and kind of <laughs> bring it a little bit. And That's right. This, looks good this will look like look we good. really know what we're doing, but yeah. the end result may not. Oh, that looks good. Nice. Okay. It doesn't look like good that. like that, but it was fun. All right. <laughs> it's going to taste good. Okay. Right. So i got to try some. I'm going back to blueberries. So there we go. Taste reach. panel. That's all right. That's okay. the official word for eating in the kitchen. You're doing the okay. uh, official taste panel. Huh. I'm this running behind schedule a little bit. Really good. <laughs> Boy, this is good. Okay. Oh, it's good. i got to have another bite. Oh, this is good. What I'm going to do is eat out of this so no one else will want to, and then I can... <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> right there you go. Mine doesn't look quite as pretty, but oh, I bet it tastes good. good. Oh, it tastes wonderful. 
Oh, oh, look how I'm beautiful sorry, you mine is. Whoops, I left a little bare spot. Oh, I'll turn this side. You didn't hit it last there. You got hit it. This side, it didn't do so well. You can put some bread in it, too. Oh, okay. Oh, you got the crumbs. All right. yeah. Get a few more crumbs. Oh, that's good. All right. Try to try it, Brandy. Well, I'm yeah? kind of getting leftovers yeah. here. Let's see. Maybe I'm. I'm sorry. I took too much. Yeah, I used it all. I'm sorry. Oh, no. I'll give you some of mine. Look at this. I just needed an excuse for not mine not looking as pretty as yours. Okay. Mark's with me though. He hadn't thrown me out yet. That's right. Wow. This, this blueberry thing, it's it's already pretty hot, and I can put the uh, oh, cornstarch yeah. right in there. And here's a fork. And when you put okay. the cornstarch oh, in, you can just do a little bit at a time. Oh, that's good. And this will thicken right up. So you can use as much mm. as you need. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Jill likes it. You're not kidding. Mm. Oh, that's good. Hey. Very good. Mine may not look as beautiful as yours. But it tastes, but it tastes just the it's same. Awesome. That's good. Mine's better. It's yep. very good. good. It tastes very good. <laughs> I may not come up for air Excellent. here. Excellent. <laughs> Y'all want to keep me quiet at home? Brandy, you want to keep me quiet at home? Just give me this and I'll be eating. Well, sure. Make right. parfait. That, right? mm -hmm. That's right. Good. Every day. Well, let's go to our next recipe here, Mark. Okay. What are we making next? We're going to do a South Padre enchilada bake. Good. You want to read that sure. recipe for us, Brandy? Sure. You'll need one pound of vegetarian burger crumbles. Four tablespoons of taco seasoning, two 15 ounce cans of enchilada sauce, 18 corn tortillas, two 15 ounce cans pinto beans drained, two green onions chopped, two cups vegan cheddar cheese shredded, one 4.5 ounce can of diced green chilies, and two cups of corn chips finely crushed. Boy, this looks good. Yeah. We got a whole thing in there. Yes. Like a smorgasbord. Yeah, it's got a few ingredients here. Yeah. Uh, you know, I had a lot of calls asking me what TVP was and all this stuff about TVP. And this is what it looks like when you come when it comes out of the grocery store. Oh. And you can even get it in the big bins. Can I feel it here? Um, it's oh, yeah. textured vegetable protein. Oh, that's oh, okay. what that is? Now, okay. when you add water to it, this amount will turn into that amount. Oh, wow. It really swells. Okay, yeah. It does. And what happens is... Um, the, the TVP mm -hmm. is no fat, no cholesterol. I like that. Mm, yeah. right. In fact, it doesn't even have any calories in it. All right. Really? Like that. This, this is one of the right best. <laughs> yeah, I've got a sheet on it somewhere here, but it Radio is so have healthy. that for a week and nothing else. <laughs> and you can use it in place of any kind of hamburger. Can you can you? use yeah. hamburger for, you can use this for. Wow. And at $2 a pound right now, it went up, it went up, it used to be a buck and a half, but two bucks a pound, mm -hmm. so you're actually paying $50 a pound, or 50 cents a pound, right. 50 soon to be $50 a <laughs> yeah. pound, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But um, 50 yeah. cents a pound, because when you add the water, you're actually ending up with four times That's as much. Right. My goodness. Mm -hmm. You know, so you're paying 50 cents a pound yeah. for hamburger. It's yeah. way cheaper than hamburger. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's Isn't that amazing? Oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, neat. and now, it's healthy. This does not have any flavor. No. So we have to add the flavor to mm -hmm. it. Oh. Okay. And we're going to get a couple of these pans cooking right yeah, here. So if you can turn both those on full blast, the two front ones here. All right. Yeah, crank it up. You got crank it. it up. Okay. And we're just right. going to go like that. Okay. So we got enough in there. And then we'll put some taco seasoning in there. Mm, cool. Like that. Yeah. And if you use the right taco seasoning that's low salt, mm -hmm. you don't have to worry about over seasoning it. Okay. If you use one that has a lot of salt, yep. you're going to end up with a salty yes. instead of a flavor. Yeah, right. right, absolutely. So, okay. And what I do, this is my little sneaky area, is add just a little bit of olive oil to oh, it. Oh, very good. And they're going to think that's the grease from like a taco. Oh, okay. Uh, I've, I've done this and people don't even know that's pretty that, amazing. It's, yeah. that it's TVP. Yeah, yeah. Right. You're getting right. tips from the chef. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Boy, that's amazing. Sometimes you'll see it called TSP. For textured soy okay. protein. Okay. Yes. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. So we're gonna let that cook okay. a little bit. All right. You want and then, to throw that here? and we're gonna get you stirring over there and bring that pan okay. over. Have All you right. ever seen a pan like that before? No, I haven't. Looks like a small kitchen sink. Well, <laughs> I love I love commercial <laughs> equipment. I just love commercial equipment. Speaking and of commercial equipment, what in the world is this? Oh, that is this, so small. This I thought was the neatest thing, because uh, everybody's got their measuring spoons. I actually use uh -huh. it for a keychain sometimes. Oh. Um, but it actually says on it, pinch, smidgen, and dash. Okay. Oh, so, like and, and if you, you know, you have to know what a if, pinch and a smidgen is. If there you're not is. old enough, yeah. then you better use that. The yeah. older folk, they Yeah, we just it. grab, we just know. So. <laughs> that's mm -hmm. right. Oh, that's yeah. cute. Okay. I like that. So what we're going to do is we're going to make our uh, enchilada I'll switch, uh, right here. Okay. And I made my own enchilada sauce. 
Oh. Uh, you can use the can, but I just made my own. What and you put in it? All you have to use is tomato sauce, okay. use some chili powder and okay. cumin, and you've got it. Now, I, I add some salt and, you know, a few other ingredients. That's pretty easy. But it's that simple. Tomato sauce, chili powder, and cumin. Right. And, and that's your enchilada that's sauce. That, yeah. And it's half the price to make it at home than it is to buy Absolutely. it pre-made. Right. Brandy, when so. it's your turn at church, yours and Jill, we expect something this looks like for potluck. Look uh -huh. like that's right. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. So I like to spray these pans a little bit, okay, just to get the bottom coated. And then when you make these, this pan is so neat because you can do his and hers. I think we've got to have to do <laughs> yeah. his and hers right really? now. Right. Gonna and you're going to layer it. No, no onion side. Right. We're going to layer it just like a lasagna. All right. So whatever. Oh. You know how you layer lasagnas? Yeah, that's right. Yes. You're doing the same thing the here. Sauce in the bottom. And uh, I always put a little sauce on the bottom. Uh, for okay. some reason, it just keeps the thing from sticking. Absolutely, and that's good. Sure. Yeah. yeah. That smells so good. It sure does. You smell that? It does. Yes. Yes. Mm. You know, we have to we get television. We need to get television where people's not just sight but smell. Smell smell vision. Vision. Yeah. smell of it. Sometimes, sometimes that would be good. Yes. That would be perfect. Well, all you have to do is just keep adding different ingredients okay okay and you can create it any way you want any way, all right and there's the tortillas and right. you just kind of start adding things to it okay all and right and you can do cheese you can do sauce so we'll have um each one, i'll yours, take this Randy. okay okay we'll have okay. each one of you make your own all right okay oh, fun. this is gonna be yeah. fun all right no i can't do the fancy thing you do <laughs> uh -huh. See, look oh, at that. Well, Oh, oh yeah, man, that's good. Don't uh, try this at home, kid. You know, <laughs> I just have to be everywhere. It's only for trained amateurs like us. You know? <laughs> well, I'm not a trained amateur. Yeah. Does the sauce have to go next, or can we? Mix you can anything? make it any way you want, okay, and we'll save since... this for the topping, though. We'll save that. For oh, the okay, topping. so what, what is that? Corn chips. Okay. Corn chips. I'll take oh. the lettuce too. You don't want to use okay. lettuce. You there. don't want. That's for me. Oh wow! Well, thank you. I was <laughs> done just... for you. That looked good. I was... Okay, all right, I'll do the sauce. Are you getting done or not yet? Mm -hmm. Yep, okay. just like that. Good. And you can even add more oil, more water, okay. whatever you need to, to You want me to shut that it. one off or not? Yeah. Okay. But you can always add a little water if you think it needs to be okay. you know, thinned down a little bit. Yeah. Isn't that yeah. nice? Perfect. Oh, yeah. Now, I'm on. now I'll show you a couple things oh. we can do with yeah, this. Fancy. Now that we have our taco meat right. done, mm -hmm. Boom, we have tacos. Okay, I'm oh, gonna grab that cool. from you. Look at this, we're gonna make a taco oh, right here. Yeah, oh, that looks good. So if you wanna make tacos, yeah. put a little lettuce yeah. on there. Yeah. You know, some tomato or bell pepper. This yeah. is tomato, these are actually fresh tomatoes from a farm right down the street here. Are you here. serious? Oh, yeah. that's nice. I like fresh, and it's the best. It you is. go like that. It's so much really better. Good. Yes. Yeah. And uh, right. just like that, and it's you've like got winter. tacos. Oh, yeah. cute. So, right. It's good not gonna stand up, but. We can lay it down. Yeah, we've got new ones there. <laughs> yeah. uh, the other thing we can do yeah. is put this right on a flour tortilla. Oh, okay. Together. About like that. Oh, you can add your lettuce. You can do anything you want. Some oh, cheese. How about some chili? You like chili? Green <laughs> chili? Um, uh huh. Yep. And you can make it any way you want. Oh, right. wow. And we're just going to roll oh, this up. Nice. You guys are doing a good job over there. Well, thanks. Thank you. Do we get <laughs> to fun. put any more of the corn layers on, or is that it? Oh, yeah. You got your burritos. Mm -hmm. Brandy, Isn't that nice? Another nice. there's corn layers, or is that right. the last? Uh, you ready for a layer of this? More. Let's come in with oh, a layer of this Oh, yeah, real quick. sure. Okay, yeah. okay I'm going to come in, and we're just going to plop some around. All right. And okay. you know the thing about this is you really can't mess it up. Yeah, you good. Just, you, can, you can make it any way you want. We did this at the camp meeting. Yeah. We just mm -hmm. did this. It was good. Meeting. It was good. It, it went over so good. Mm -hmm. That was so yeah, this, good. This it was great. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And if you want to put a big flower one in the middle, you can just plop a big yeah. flower. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I like it. I'll give you one, too. Thank yeah. you. No, I'm going to leave one corn. Oh, oh that's okay. good. Okay. Um, Already. A lot of people uh, are celiacs. That's right. So they can't have the flour. Oh, so I see. So we're going to leave that with just the okay. corn. Okay. They can have corn, uh, rice, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's yeah. Good. It gives okay. people options. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that means now, then if we do that, we need a little more. We've got to move to the next recipe. What would, how, how would we end it, finish on the top? You're just going to top it all off any way you want and put it so right it in the matter. oven. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's it bake at? Uh, 350 for about an hour. For about an hour. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. And, and you can cover it or you can okay. leave it open where it gets crispy on the top. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. Isn't that nice? Let's go to our next recipe here. Okay. Um, Danny, you want to read that recipe for us? The Lone Star, Lone Star Chili. Lone Star Chili. Okay, uh, three tablespoons of vegetable oil, two pounds of TVP drained, two large sweet onions diced, one green bell pepper diced, 
fresh garlic to taste mints. Now, I love you all, or I wouldn't be reading garlic and peppers and all of that. <laughs> One quarter cup chili powder or to taste. I like that. Salt and pepper to taste. A one quarter teaspoon of cayenne pepper to taste. Three tablespoons of ground cumin. Cumin. All right. And uh, let's see, one 14 ounce can of tomato sauce. Yeah. Oh, and, there's more. And then All we're right. going to go with a wow. 28 ounce can of diced tomatoes. Thank you. And some red kidney beans, okay. pinto beans. You can use any kind of beans you want. Okay. And then add a couple tablespoons of sugar at the okay. end. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, I love chili. Let's see how to make this here. Yeah. You know, there's a hundred ways to make chili. Uh -huh. I mean, uh, once you get the basics down, mm -hmm. then you can pretty much run with it. Yeah. A lot of people, what they'll do is they're going to take the onions in there first. Yeah. You can crank this one on All right. uh, for the flames. Okay. Yeah. And then they'll put a little olive oil in there. Yeah. And they're going to let that saute for a little while. All right. Okay. Or you can take the bell peppers and you can saute those in there for a little while. Okay, right? yeah. And you can make them so they brown, a little translucent. I like that because uh, I don't like them raw. I'm not into right. raw things. Mm -hmm. no. <laughs> yeah. Now, me being cooking yeah. 40 pounds, 100 pounds, 200 pounds of chili at a time, I don't mess with it. That's pretty So I just put it all in the pot. Here's the diced tomatoes. Stand back. All right. Don't try this at home with a white shirt, all right? <laughs> Woo! Good job. Woo! There we yeah, go. That's good, huh? Yeah. That one's all fresh. Right. Yes. And then the tomato sauce, which I like to use, the tomato oh, sauce. Yeah. Very good. Okay. okay. And then we add those two beans right there. This is that TVP. Remember we were doing the TVP before? Yeah. It's already seasoned, just like hamburger. If you use hamburger in your chili, start using yeah. TVP. It'll save you money and it's better for you. Oh, yeah, that's right. right. So Gives you good we're going to put that right in there. Good. Okay. I like it because you can make it and you can use it for so many different things. Right. Yeah. 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 Variety. That's good. Yeah. And we've got pinto beans and kidney beans. You ready for them? Yep. All, All right. Them in? Yeah, I just throw everything in there. Uh, right. All at once. Okay. Okay. And Always kidney beans. Throw something. There you go. <laughs> there you and uh, this is a, a lot of times, too, I'll wait on the, on the beans. I'll, like, cook it for an hour. Yeah. And then after that, then I'll throw the beans in. Yeah. It really doesn't matter, but, you know. A lot of times I'll do that because I can just mix it around. And, uh -huh. All right. This is a uh, chili powder. Yeah. And cumin. And yeah. then we have um, some sugar. Yeah. Sweeten it up a little bit. Yeah. Sugar. And uh, cayenne. All right. Oh. Give you a lot. Yeah. And a little garlic. <laughs> yeah. A little bit of garlic. Yeah. Garlic is good. You got to make sure you cook it. Mm -hmm. You know, it keeps you from burping garlic. Oh. Uh, you know, that's so no fun. yeah. Um, <laughs> as long as you cook it, you know, it'll it'll be right. fine. Right. Well, we're going to mix yeah. this up, mm. and this is a, a heavy it's bean a nice Texas It's chili. real hearty. sure is. Mm. And one of the things, if you can find this, I have it um, with my spices, okay. is Guadalajara chili pepper. Mm. Mm. All right. And it's so expensive, but oh, is it? when you smell it, you'll know why. It's, a, mm. it's just such nice. an aromatic sure is. Uh, flavor. Yeah. So that's probably too much. Oops, <laughs> I better put some more in. That's probably too much, is it? Oops, I better no, put I'm some more in. <laughs> <laughs> you like it spicy? <laughs> we'll spice oh, it up. Oh. You can tell I use a lot of it Thank by how empty you. it right. is. So. It's not for me. <laughs> it's Texas. It's uh -oh. Texas. Yep. So that's it. And, and there's our finished product right oh, there. Great. Oh, yeah. Sour cream on it. Oh, yeah. Great. And we With can... the little onions. It's good. Let's go to our next recipe. Mm -hmm. For the Texas cheese steak, steak sandwiches. sandwiches. You want to read that and, first, Brandy? Mm -hmm. Sure. One large eggplant peeled and sliced, olive oil, salt and pepper, fresh basil, three cups of sliced onions, one tablespoon soy sauce, two tablespoons water, four six-inch sub rolls, and eight slices of vegan cheddar cheese. Boy, this looks good. And mm -hmm. use an eggplant in it. It's that easy. Mm, yeah. Wow. Where most people do a Philly cheesesteak, we're doing a right. Texas cheesesteak with uh, okay. eggplant. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. So we can turn these burners on here. Okay. <laughs> and we're going to get a few of these eggplants in here. All right. And I just sliced them, you know, yeah. about a quarter inch, half inch. Peel them and slice them. Yeah, yeah, you can do them any way you want like that. Yeah. Okay. And the flames are going. Right. Right. Danny, I got something here for you. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Just saute oh, yeah. onions. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. Here, we'll just do them all up there. Mm -mm. And we can even do a little olive want. oil for you. Okay. And then right here, we're going to do a little olive oil there. Okay. okay. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. Yes. Is olive oil your, your oil of choice? I love it. Yeah. 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 It's got good flavor, too. So we've got the onions going, we've got the eggplant going. Good. Uh, this is fresh basil. You can also use dried if you yes. want. Um, I just kind of. But the fresh is so much better, you know? Uh -huh. Craving yes. for fresh. 
Yeah. You know, you oh. think it's yeah. 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 And the secret ingredient? You grow your own. Uh oh, you're not yeah. telling? The secret ingredient? Oh. Soy sauce. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And we can use that just like that. Yeah. And all we're going to do is get these things cooking. Ooh, that's a good yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. Well. All right. Yeah. Whoop. There we go. Boy, that's good. Okay. Can you do good. that with the eggplant, too? <laughs> Did you try that, Mom. Brandy? No. You want to try that? No. Mm. Ooh, with a little water. Wow. Oh, mercy. Wow. Get wow. Good job. Back. Woo. <laughs> Okay. Did it. Um, with did the bread, it. you can use any kind of bread you want. Okay. There's two different ways you can cut it. You can actually cut it right through like this. All right. Yes. And then open it up. Oh yeah. Perfect. To put the uh, items. Mm -hmm. yeah. Or the other way you can do it is just to cut the top off of it like this. Oh, that's cute. And I like doing it like this because you can come in here and oh, actually wow. take out part of your bread. You know, people are on the low carb kind of yeah. diets. Yeah. Sure. Good idea. You can just take out that entire bread area there. Cute. And create a pocket huh? like that. Yeah. Okay. All right. Isn't that neat? That is neat. That is, is very good. cute. Yeah. yeah. I like it. And you put more goodies in it. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 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 exactly. That's right. Uh, two things you can do with this: you can either, you can grill it, oh, the or you can you can grill it, or you can put it in the oven afterwards. Oh yeah. And so we're kind of kind of put it in the oven afterwards. Okay. Mm -hmm. But that's all there is to it. It actually kind of turns into a little steak meal. Yeah. Uh -huh. You know, this uh, onions is kind of white. <laughs> you can bad. actually hit both of them with some salt and pepper if you yeah. want. Yeah, sure. And um, there you go. Oh, cool. That's a fancy gadget. Rock salt. Yeah. 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 I gave it to her. I wasn't sure how it worked. <laughs> she knew, though. That's what you were doing. Yeah. I thought. I wasn't sure. I was Send in the pros. Drink. Send in the pros. That's right. We're Here, honey, you can do this one. Now, this one. That's amazing. That's a little bit of paprika. So just do that on the onions. Just a little. People, this is a trick that nobody knows, but, okay. you know, more, 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 more. Oh, more. Yeah, just want... crank it on. Okay. More, more, more. Well, we're All running right. against the clock here, so just tell us what we do with this. Okay. Anymore. All right. We're going to go. There you go. A lot. Real heavy. Oh, mercy. Yeah. Right. It actually turns yellow. Yeah, sure does. Paprika, red paprika sure turns yes, the onions yellow. Isn't that okay. amazing? It's pretty. All right. It's good. So, so, put them here. This is going to go right here. Okay. You can just fill in your pocket with that. Oh, perfect. And then you put some onions on it, too. Don't try this at home, kids. Yeah. Caliente. <laughs> caliente. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. And then you can hit it with some onions right on top. Oh, that looks good. Like that. Right. That looks great. Yeah, and that uh, good. cheese. This good. is one you can create anyway. You know what we're missing? What? Something. We're missing the entree that Danny and Brandy yeah, made. You better pull it out real it's quick. It's in the oven. Yeah. It's in the oven. Let me grab that real well, quick. He's grabbing it. I want right. Okay, here we go. I'm going to grab it out of the oven. Really nice. I forgot all about this. All right. Ooh, hot stuff coming uh -oh. over. Let's see how Danny and Brandy did tonight. Right. Wow. Yay! It was Way to go! Show. Good job! Yeah. Good job! I like this guy. Very good. Very good. Yeah. yeah. Good teacher. You guys did a good job. Good teacher. <laughs> so and we have our Texas um, steak sandwiches here, mm -hmm. so we can oh, look at them. That's beautiful. the final product. What yeah. they look like. Yeah. Boy, they're beautiful. They are. They're nice. They are. They really are. Good job, okay. Mark. Yeah. Great job. Good and then job. Um, our last thing that we're going to do is we're going to get doing some cake. We're going to yeah, do the dessert and put the whole thing together. <laughs> okay. That's All right. right. But first, friends, um, if you want to contact Mark, we've had such a good time in the kitchen here, but if you'd like to contact Mark and have him come to your area and do a, a program for your church or speak or if you'd like his spices, here's the information that you will need to contact Mark for yourself. If you would like to contact Mark Anthony to find out what recipes he has to offer, you may write to Mark Anthony, Post Office Box 20861, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89112. That's Mark Anthony, Post Office Box 20861, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89112. You may call 702-236-3280. That's 702-236-3280. Or visit his website for cookbooks and cooking supplies. It's chefmarkanthony.com. It's all one word, Chef Mark anthony.com call or write to him today he'd love to hear from you well we're here friends with the cake that mark anthony made us for camp meeting mm -hmm. yes right. we did a super sized one at camp meeting this one's going to be a little bit smaller but i think you'll get the idea of uh, how to create these that's awesome we're going to show you how to make it so yep let's we're going to show you how to make it yeah so the first thing i did i put some saran wrap down for this one sometimes i do sometimes i don't but Okay. Nice table. I wanted to take care of it. We're going to be messy. Sure that, All right. Uh -huh. <laughs> be messy. Use it again. So, 
Okay. And we just put four cakes down. You can kind of make any cakes you want. This is a spice cake that and you can And I am going to just start going to town here. Mm. Mm -hmm. Spice cake. You, I used oh, spice yeah. cake and I used a butter pecan cake on this one. Ooh, oh, that yeah. sounds good. Yes. Oh, yeah. And I like to hit the edges like this because okay. that way the blueberry doesn't go seeping through it. All right. That's the whole oh, trick okay. here. All right. Mm -hmm. That's good. Giving away all my trade secrets. Yeah. You are. Yeah. Well, thank you for doing that. That's right. <laughs> It's like well, this tape, is something that, drywall. Right. if you're having a big party oh, yeah, or something, right. mm -hmm. this is great. I'm going to grab one of those big cakes over okay. there. Okay. We can make it a little bigger and have the cross right there. Look at that. That's it. Look at that. I just saw it. Yeah, I just saw perfect. it. Yep. yep. Here. Yep. Okay. There we go. I'm going to let you hang on to this. Okay. And we'll start getting pieces out of here. Okay. Da, 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 da. So it doesn't have to look perfect. No, it doesn't. Taking the pieces just, out and they're kind yeah. of crumbled. That's okay. Then spin it around. Okay. Man. Now, is this the same type of cake? Uh, this one, did? I can't remember what I did. I okay. think I did. I think I did do a spice cake there. Okay. Yeah. Nice. And well, the cake doesn't have to be perfect. That's the nice part about it, you know? I like that. I can handle okay. that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> and we're going to pull this big piece out of here. Ooh, okay. Don't try this at home now. Here we go. Oh, oh there we go. Ooh, okay. nice. Island. South Padre Island, right there right. for you. Yeah. All right. There's South Padre Island. All right, nice. <laughs> Yep. This is like I've actually done this type of thing for a lot of celebrities in Las Vegas. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. And we would just get so carried away with them that <laughs> yeah. you know, they would just be in awe, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mostly for the entertainers. I would actually entertain the entertainers. Wow. That's Ooh, the way I do it. That's neat. So Yeah. And wow. you can just keep going like that. Yeah. And your set is working at home. It's not speeded up. It just looks like it's speeded up. <laughs> fast as it's working. Right. That's uh -huh. That's Don't right. Don't call your technician. Okay, we're going to this up. Get the other one if you want. Then okay. Okay. I don't know. Ready? Here we go. Woo! Woo! Okay. Big one right there. Nice. Yeah. Good. Okay. You want we got one more here? piece. I'm all right. You yeah, we got it. Okay. We got it. Crew will eat we that one. <laughs> That's right. I think the crew's looking at this one. Yeah. I can see yeah, their eyes over there. Yeah. Their mouths are watering That's already. Right. Oh. Yes. So. Okay, Wait, I'm going to spin it around real quick. Okay. I've got help on this one. This yeah, is nice. Yeah, That's pretty nice. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. How long did it take you to do the one for camp meeting? About three hours. Really? Do you know that's fast, yeah. though? You think that we're going to stuff? Yes. Now we're going to kind of cut in beautiful. here. Yes. Mm -hmm. And we're going to lift this one up. That camp Look. meeting was huge. Wasn't it? Oh, it was a gigantic cake. Yeah, the length of a whole table. Yeah, it was. <laughs> it was. Like I said, you can do this. Look at see the different wow. colors I have already. Yeah. That's neat. Isn't that neat? Mm -hmm. And let's even do a high spot here. We'll do a high spot there. Okay. Right. okay. And now's when you can start really getting creative. Okay, one more up there. Why not? <laughs> yeah, that's right. And that's we'll come right wow. back here. And there we go. Hold like this right. area up. <laughs> that's okay. Right. That's pretty neat. Are we done yet? Are we done yet? <laughs> uh, I could eat this. Okay, this, this looks beautiful. Yeah. Yep, okay. I think that's going to do on that. What do you need next? Um, what do we got next in the list there? The peanut brittle, is that next? That'll work, you bet. Now this is the peanut brittle we made. Yeah, we just made peanut brittle. Yeah. Yes. Right. So we're going to take a couple pieces like this and don't try this at home, kids. Woo! <laughs> I like right. that. Yeah. I'm just going to put some okay. pieces in here like Very this. Nice. All right. And I think I'll even kind of go underneath there a little bit, huh? I wonder if we can get a piece on top. Hey, oh, that's I think that's going to work. Is. That's really huh? nice. And we can go like that. Yeah. Okay, and some seashells. We got seashells, seashells. over there. And what are we going to do with seashells? We're just going to... Dress it up? Yep. I can actually make seashells out of sugar. Wow. But um, okay. I don't do it very often. Now, right now, I'm just kind of chopping up the sides Whoa. so that it won't look... Like a cake. Right. <laughs> Oh, really? Because you don't want anything that actually looks uniform here. That's okay. the thing I was yeah. real impressed with. You know, when Brandy and I went over to the cake, yeah. remember Sabbath morning? Yeah. Yes. And I thought, it doesn't even look like a cake. Yeah, right. it was it so good. I walk, it was so, uh, yeah. I walked by it and didn't know what it was at first. Right. Everybody Absolutely. said, you see the big cake? Okay. No. Just like oh. that. And then we'll grab the pearls. All right. Got pearls. Okay. Candy pearls. <laughs> All right. Made without um, uh, gel. Wow, okay. Yep. Yeah, no, and, no uh, gelatin in these. And the okay. um, carob, these are like carob. Oh, yeah. Because, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, if you're going to have pearls, all, sometimes you'll find a little yeah. black one in there. So. Oh, right. cute. Isn't that cute? You can go like it's that. Very cute. Okay, and then we're going to go with the next thing in line. The, the spray or the... Yeah, we can spray. We we'll can spray use this. this, okay. Yep. Woo! want some spray, too. Now, now what's this? This is um, spearmint. Is 
Spider. Oh, okay. okay. That's I pretty know what neat. That was. <gasps> oh, isn't that neat? You just spray a green on it. Huh? Yeah. And these two have alcohol and non-alcoholic. Uh, okay. So We're using non-alcoholic. That's right. <laughs> In case you're interested. Okay. That's amazing. And you got a red one? I'll take a red a one. A red one? You guys can start spraying got... over there if yeah, you this want. It's open, okay. I think. There we go. Right. Yeah, and just keep spraying on that side a little bit. Okay, here. I got help. Yeah. I got help today. All right. And you know, you really can't that. mess this up. Yeah. You really I'll can't open. mess it up. All right. So just what is this? Open. But... I'm fun. Yeah. What is it? Just color? Huh? Just cut a hay brand. Yes. Hey. 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 Let's go. A little binocular blast. Right. The binocular right. blast. And now I'm going to go with the, um, the blueberry. Right, well, Get him. Let's go. We're, we're uh, fuming in here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And now we're going to go with the blueberry. Okay. Blueberry. Okay. Uh, and a little bit on. of this like that. Just huh? Some. Boom. I like a little mint everywhere. It just really gives okay. it a nice scent. Okay. Thank here we go. All right. Let me see if I can do this right. Whoa. That's the lake. Nuts. Yes, nuts. the Blueberry nuts. Lake. Blueberry right. Lake. Unreal. South Padre Island. There you go. You're having too much this. fun with Woo. this, Mark. Go. I'm going to need that uh, whip, though, on the way back. There you go. Whipped cream. This whip? Yep. Okay. This? Oh, no, that, that whip. thing. Oh. He said whip. That was cute. Somebody says that whip around me. I, I got him when I was home and a kid. I get nervous. You say whip. There go. One more time? Okay, we can do it more. I'll take All off right. running. More. We'll wow, look at that. Full. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Okay. Oh, that look cool? Full. Yeah. Wow. Yep. Yeah. And you just create cool. it whatever yeah. way God thinks that you should create it. You can oh. make it any way you That's want. Nice. You know that yeah. is. That's right. Yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah. Look at that. Okay, so we're gonna take care of that, and then we're gonna go to the dry stuff over here. The I'm gonna get a quick thing? rinse on my hands. Take a look at this really close if you like. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's. I like the lake. Me too. It's full. It looks full like there's water. Yeah. 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 Get a little close up here. I'm going to dry my hands for a second. I'm not sure how healthy this is, but once a year we'll allow this. <laughs> right there, okay, we want to be balanced. Yeah. Well, the nice part is okay. that you can actually freeze all this. You can throw it in the freezer, throw it in little containers, oh, you know, and right. you know, just make Thanksgiving, yourself. Thanksgiving, Christmas, yeah, whenever. You okay. Bet. Mm -hmm. All right. I think we have enough people here that they're going to take care of it, though. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's and, right. Uh, we got enough people to eat it. <laughs> I do want to bust up the sides if you guys want to just kind of oh, bust up the sides a little bit over there. Just break them up. Just the way it looks. So it doesn't look natural. <laughs> Oh, I see. Or so it does look natural, I guess. Okay. I did wash like my hands. Yeah, you did. We all did. Yeah. And see how I think far that we was can reach today. It could have been yesterday. <laughs> it was today. <laughs> we hope so. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Just so it doesn't. Because uh, anything that looks straight or uniform, you know, okay. yeah. it's, it's a mechanical yeah. type of thing. Yeah, you have built an island. Here we go. You have built an island for sure. Well, that's amazing. Yep. It is. Oh, this is fun. Fun, fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's fun. You can do it with your kids. Yes. You know, get them in the kitchen and you know, have a good, good time. Is. There's no knives and no hot, you know, That's no, true. no heat. So yeah. It's not like you're in That's a good point. Now, you can actually make these that are just the size of one cake. Wow. Can okay? you? Yeah. This is just the concept of how to be wow. creative in the kitchen. This is more fun. You can yeah, actually. This is a blast, <laughs> really. You can do little, little things all the time with this. And this is the sand oh. at the beach. Now we're going to start with all the. Go do one of these yeah. at home. Want some big yeah, beaches? Go. we got big beaches here. We'll put a big beach right up okay. front nice. here. How's that? Do you want the granola? I think that's a good place it's for like a beach. Sand. Yep. There you go. And this granola, you can use lots of health foods in here, too. You don't have to use a lot of the uh, somewhere? stuff like we use. Going? How you want it. And we're just going to put it everywhere. You just put clumps of it. Okay. See how we do clumps it? of it? In clumps. And I'm going to switch clumps. with you. We'll switch okay. colors here. All right. Uh-huh. Oh, this is fun. It is. Isn't this I neat? love it. I want to stop. Yeah. yeah. You can go right on top, anywhere you want to go. You can't mess it up. That's the That's funny awesome. part about it. What, are, what, is, what do we have here? What, yeah, what's this that? all go on it, too? Uh-huh. This is actually a... Uh, Wheat-free uh, oh, product that I found. That's pretty okay. nice. It just looks kind of neat, and when you stack Makes some up, feel a little better. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. And I see almonds too. Are they going on? Uh huh. All right. Ooh, those are good. Just, those are healthy, right? Yeah. That's something healthy. Yeah. See, look. We'll just, here, I'll let you probably know what it's supposed to look like finished. And you can do nuts. You can do any kind of little yeah. creations you want here. Yeah. I'm not so sure. Much. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we got to take huh? a break here, you guys. Oh, oh okay. we're going to take a break, and we got to go to our news break. Okay. But in just a moment, we'll be back, and we're going to show you how we finish out this delicious cake. So stay with us. We have great news for you this week. Hello, I'm Molly Steenson, and today I have Julia Utkina and Moses Primo with me for a wonderful announcement. Julia, tell us what's happening in Russia. 
Molly, the Lord has been blessing Russian 3ABN and since 1993 we have produced up to 5,000 Russian language programs. We are on about 150 television stations across the ex-Soviet Union as well as three satellite channels and now God is opening a wonderful opportunity to have our own full-time internet channel and we are calling it Three Angela in Russian which is in English Three Angels. There are approximately 300 million people in the world who speak the Russian language and we want to reach all of them for Jesus. I can't tell you how excited we are about this and we believe the Lord will bless our efforts to spread the gospel around the world. A Russian language channel 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Moses, how can our people receive this new channel? Well, Molly, actually there are two ways. The first way and the best way that we are recommending is using the IPTV box. This box has a good quality and you do not need a computer or a satellite dish to uh, watch this channel. All that you need is a high-speed internet connection and connect two cables. One cable goes to your high-speed internet and the other cable goes to the in video input of your TV set. And then you can choose the three angular channel from the 11 channels that we currently have. This box also has a great feature which stores in the memory 48 hours of programming and then you can choose any program that you have missed or if you want a selective uh, program you can just uh, choose any time you want. The second way that uh, we have to watch this uh, ch new channel is uh, through the internet in a regular computer. If you have uh, a high-speed internet, you can stream uh, by going to mopcweb.com uh, or if you wanted the box, you can go to moiptvnet. And uh, these are the two ways that you can uh, watch this new channel. Or if you have any further questions, uh, feel free to call us at 1-877-369-8560 or if you are outside of the United States, we have also a local number, it's 618-627-2300. Uh, so November 1st, we're going to start this new channel, and you can tell your friends that uh, have a, a Russia-speaking uh, need, they can watch uh, this new channel. Thank you, Moses and Julia. And if the Holy Spirit impresses you to support this channel, you may contact us anywhere in the world at 1-618-627-4651. Thank you, and may God richly bless you. Welcome back, friends. We've been working on the cake. As you can see, Mark's been making it a lot of progress. It is turning out Excellent. really good. It is. Beautiful. If you, uh -huh. if you get some close-ups, I'm putting some uh, sharks in the ocean. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> or some people think they're sailfish. I they're yeah. sail, sailboats or sailboats. Sail, yeah, sail, that's something. Right. Yeah. And they're just made out of white chocolate. Okay. White chocolate. He's got beach made out of pretzels. Got little. Um, yeah, the little umbrellas on the beach with the yeah. pretzels. Yeah, beach towels. Yes. All kinds of yeah. Things. Oh, it's cute. That's probably why there's no people though, because the sharks are all around. <laughs> <laughs> Too many. That's what it is. Yeah. Well, that's, that's right. amazing creation. It I is. Love something. You did such a good job. Yes. Excellent. Nothing and like And you can this. just play around with this. And here's some. This is some rock candy. Oh yeah. Okay. okay. And we get some yeah. rocky areas rock. here. Yeah. Uh huh. That's nice. Yeah. And we have a video roll of... Oh, we do, from the... From camp meeting. From the camp meeting. The big no, cake? Yeah, yeah. That's from the big cake. Oh, yeah, we want to see yeah. that. Yeah, so let's take a look at that now. Oh, there, oh, there it is. You can see wow. it. It's there it is. Bigger. Oh, yeah. Compared to the people look at yes. it. Yes, yeah. that's right. Now, that one was four foot by eight foot. Wow. Is that right? Four so by eight, like a piece be... of plywood. Yep, <laughs> just like a four by eight foot <laughs> yeah. piece of plywood. Yeah. That is a big... Isn't that amazing. something? You can see the sand. There's the, the beach. Yeah. With there the beach go. towels. and the... Oh. Wow. Mm. They did a good job of filming oh, that. Yeah, they did. Boy, oh, boy. It's very nice. And there's the trees with your parsley. Just when you think you've seen it all. That's right. <laughs> you can see people coming in. Somebody. Look at it. Oh, there's the ocean. Look at the way it shimmers. I know it does. It looks like water. Doesn't that look like Yeah. Wow. Well, yeah. Brandon would be missing Florida now. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Uh, I know. <laughs> and I think I'm going to put a few more beach towels fun. on the beach over here. Uh, yeah. Now, how did you make your umbrellas, Mark? The umbrellas are uh, uh, white chocolate on the bottom. Okay. Just take pretzels, pretzels. and you make that's them any pretzels. way you want. Huh. And what will happen is when you start doing this, uh -huh. 
even on small scales for home, yeah. you're always going to come up with new ideas, and it's all, it's just expanding your mind to say, hey, look at all the things I can do in the right. kitchen. Because right. most people go recipe by recipe, ding, 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 ding. Right. And this yeah. just kind of expands your mind to say, hey, there's more things I can do out here. And you can be creative. Yeah. Definitely. Mm -hmm. I mean, this does not look like a cake. Oh, you need some beach towels know, not over at there? All. <laughs> not at all. Put some at all. beach towels down. And apricots. Oh, oh where's the go. green? We need the green. Uh, oh, here you go. The, right there. The greenery. Oh, the uh, parsley. Yeah, and you can use parsley. Oh, actually, red uh, Is that Italian? Did some mint. Okay, mint. I've got yeah. two different types of parsley here. Nice. So and I'll give you like some. trees on the beach. Yeah. Trees, sure. Yeah, just yeah. any greenery. I'll oh, give yeah. you some over there. Palm trees. Nice. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, once in a while, you just have to stop, though, because yeah. I find myself three hours see. later still, <laughs> yeah. still expanding on it. Oh, yeah, so. that's right. Especially when there's only two minutes left in this program. Yeah. <laughs> right. to, we'll yeah, be stopping. It all that's right. Yeah. <laughs> but you'll get the idea at home, and that's what's yes. important, yeah. you know, yes. to understand yeah. how to do it. That's yeah. neat. Yeah. Oh, that's well, nice. Look unreal. At that. Now, kids, you can try this one at home. <laughs> yeah, that's right. right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Okay. That's right. Wow, look at it. And you got right. the little life saver. Scoop. Good deal. Isn't like that beautiful? That. Yeah. Oh, it's it a beautiful is. cake. Put some dried apricots here. Now, how'd you come up with this okay. idea, Mark? You know, it just came to me. I, I Actually, I was flying over um, the desert, and I saw the lakes and the rivers oh, and stuff. Okay. And I was saying, I can do that with food. Wow, and, and that's I, neat. Wow, isn't you know, kind of went from you know, there. It is. What a gift. It is that, that is a gift. It is. Yeah. Yeah. Surely is. God's creation coming out, that's and right. food even. That's right. Well, that's wonderful. I think, I think I'm done. <laughs> I think I'm done. <laughs> yeah. oh. Bravo. Yay. Good, good job. job. Thank you. We can't Beautiful. wait to eat, make this cake and eat it. Yes. <laughs> and eat it. Yes. You can have your cake and eat it, too. And eat it, too. All right. I've always heard you couldn't, but maybe we can. Can you see how the sand is starting to actually look like like a beach, you know, it is. Yeah. it's absorbed it like a little bit moist. Yep. Yeah, right yeah, it that's is. neat. That's Unreal. Yeah. yeah, okay. Oh, well, thank you for coming, Mark. Oh, it's that's been a pleasure. Such it's a good it's time. been a pleasure. Yeah. Yes. yeah, you have uh -huh. so much talent. God's blessed you with absolutely. Uh -huh. Yeah, and we had such a good time at Camp Meeting, too, with, with food. Yes, yeah, it was really good. Yeah, yeah. and mm -hmm. thanks to both of you guys. Well, thanks for having us. Thank you. Next time we come, I'm going to have one of those chef hats and one of those. That's right. I think that's what I'm going to do next time. You can be the sous chef. Yeah, <laughs> right. That'd be a good the idea. The sushi. Uh, that's right. I like All right. I got his coat right here. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Oh, All right. All right. Yeah, thank you much for coming in today. Wow, I feel I very great. much appreciated. <laughs> I don't know if there you go. That's you pretty much. This is a bad idea or a coat. Oh, okay. It's there a big go. coat, but it'll fit Let's you. Let's see here. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, yeah. Well, so friends, like we had it? a good time today, but our time is all gone. It yeah. goes so fast, especially when we're having fun. Yes, but enjoy these does. recipes. Take them to your home and to your heart. Share them with your family and friends. And we'll see you next time. God bless. Uh -huh.